Hello everyone, welcome to your August 2019 reading. Before I begin, read your sign. I want to announce this month is the Gilded Tarot, Gilded Tarot deck to give away. Okay, so if you want to enter the competition, all you need to do is to leave me a comment and I will choose the winners from the comment section. For personal readings, you have my website and in the description box below, you can find my email address as well if you have any questions about what reading is best for your situation okay you can email me and then go to the website okay so thank you so much everyone for your likes shares and subscribes and let's now begin with your reading hello taurus welcome to your reading taurus sun moon rising and venus signs august 2019 taurus August. Okay, memories, sweet memories, but a storm angel, a clash of energies, attitudes, ghost people. So there's someone from your past. Time for change. Maybe it's time to change your number. I heard here. Uh, or the way you communicate and use the internet, the technology all together. Okay, who you keep on your social media. If you don't want people from the past telling you to make some changes. There could be someone really... Um, with a different uh, opinion on your Facebook and really having a debate here, even an argument, online argument for some of you. But there is um, the page of water, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Someone wanting to work things out. There's also Earth sign. Someone wanting to work things out, apologizing. You're receiving a message. Okay, the page, pages bring messages. This is a message of love. Could be even uh, the place that this person works or you do work here. It could come into your work or through, uh, I don't know, an email, a work email, something related to your, even calling your, your workplace to speak to you. The High Priestess is in the past. So this person has kept quiet for a while. Queen of Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius with the Four Cups. Okay. So someone really, um, it could be you or you thinking about um, standing your ground here. If, if you don't like it, you're going to cut it off. If you don't like this, I, I feel you have this four of cups energy where you're not satisfied with your current uh, circumstances for the ones that feel like that. Maybe a bit bored. You may be the one communicating or, uh, you know, someone really is communicating with you, but you may not want to speak to them anymore. Foundation, Taurus. Yeah, there's arguments, five of air. So there is definitely, um, the ghost people I do even see, like people are stalking you online. Okay, so be mindful um, of that because, you you know, trying to cause an argument with you or after an argument, they're still going to be stalking you. They're still going to be watching you. Not stalking. Stalking is quite, uh, in you know, intense uh, word for... What I'm trying to say is more, you know, they're watching you. They could even be watching you in in the work situation here. People are trying to see what you're doing, trying to see what you, uh, how you do things. Near future, Taurus. Oh, the king of air. And the Six of Cups. <laughs> so you got an air sign coming in from your past. I feel that it's air or water. 
this person could have just really um, if it's not one of those signs it's just someone that was cold gave you the cold shoulder Taurus you see yourself August the strength card could be a Leo okay the nine of air so you're feeling that you need to some of you are overthinking and you need to um, be mindful of what, of your thoughts and the strength cards is you showing I feel that you're gonna have to show some bravery or some uh, strength here in terms of being in control and staying cool collected yeah this is someone you see how cool they are they they're ice cold <laughs> they're really ice cold so i think oh i think that really is um the attitude that you are going to have and this person is going to match it but one of you really want to The two of cups exterior this is a soulmate I think deep down you still have feelings if you didn't you had you know um, well the one day's exterior this person really does care if you don't this person does okay they really do care about you in your emotions We've got the Wheel of Fortune and these two that flipped out. Empress, two of their... Okay, so this is someone that... Could have two people, okay? Um, or in your emotions, you could really um, be trying to walk a new path. There is a lot of um, attention here towards you because you're looking attractive, very attractive here. And the decision that you need to make is really focus on what's best for you moving forward, uh, Taurus. This could be a mother figure for some of you that is around you or this person. Um, the two of it is to do with a decision to, to kind of... Um, you know, get out of this conflict with them. So the mother of your children or there is uh, the mother of their children surrounding them still, but it feels like it's going in your favor, especially emotionally. They do love you and not this person anymore. So there is juggling. Some of you really... Torn, torn between two people or this person you know is here and there here and there everywhere not everywhere but they're here and they're there they're trying to you know oh the hierophant is you Taurus it looks like the chariot I was gonna say this is chariot so some of you could be a cancer this is the you know making a decision to stay committed okay also and I think they're gonna choose you because that's what is in the outcome the decision is you and, and with this here the two of cups them feeling like this they want to choose you so if you felt that there was you know and you know or you felt there was someone or they were juggling their time you know and not be a hundred percent committed to you they want to choose you for some Taurus, you need to make a decision. There is someone that really does care, but you both act up um, or act and hide your feelings. You both could be could be an air energy here, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or if you have a rising in um, air, it could be that it's coming through in August. Is really coming through well you've got the king of wands Leo Sag Aries 
But this is uh, the t someone is very passionate about you. Like I said, the give and take is not balanced. You will be. The choice uh, is going to be is going to be yours. Or they're going to choose you, okay? So this, the moon card is, you're going to know why this is happening with the moon card uh, reversed. I feel that you're also ready. You're also ready to find out what it is. And look, the Ten of Swords is you forgiving. They want forgiveness, okay? Or you... You may have conflict over and over and over again with this person. I'm sensing some of you as a family member, a, a mother, or their mother is um, really causing mother-in-law, or you know, if you are in a relationship already, your mother is giving you advice or telling you, or even arguing with you and seeing things that she doesn't like you see if you're going to continue arguing and it's not going to be resolved because the three of pentacles is not you being um, you not wanting to work things out but I think that there is uh, a better decision that you can make here, Taurus. King of Swords and the Six of Water. So, okay, manifestation and ready. Some, someone had a lot of choices and now feels ready to come back to you, okay? Uh, you could also be manifesting some um, someone back into your life so you have more options okay so you you want a um, hmm, backup plan you feel that you need this person in your life or they feel they need you in your in in their life things are not fully um, closed between the two of you and it's a sense of uh, someone overcoming some type of uh, depression even they felt depressed they felt depressed and now they could really do things embrace a new cycle embrace closing this chapter Going, they're coming back. They're going back. Are you wanting to go back to, you know, to see what you, what can be done? Because this still has a way to go. You can't run away from this. Or well, they can't. They can't no longer run away. Even though they keep their options open, they're going to make a decision, and the decision is to be with you tower reverse so they want to rebuild okay avoiding avoid the arguments avoid conflict or people um you see the ghost people is people that you don't even know they having an input in in your relationship or in your life you know even in social media there's so many People that just want to be there to spy and to talk about your life, you know. Nine of air and strength cards. How do you see yourself, Taurus? All right, the wish fulfilled, coming out of being single. Some of you, it's, it's going to be that, coming out of being single. And that's the nine of cups. That's a lot of... Um, even I'm seeing the strength to do this, to really commit to someone or someone really committing to you. It takes strength. <laughs> the strength card is here. It's not easy for you or them. The two of water. 
Page of Swords and the Three of Swords. So yes, there was um, a lot of immaturity, a lot of, um, again, gossip that needs to be resolved. Five of Pentacles, okay. And um, trying to heal this relationship, it's going to be the... where you're going to feel it's... Um, especially the communication with them. And if there is children involved, it's um, financially also. Having that financial help, them wanting you to help out financially or you expecting someone to help you out financially. But I see that Some of you, you were avoiding, you were avoiding getting back with this person because you feel that it's going to be heartbreak again. Why is the Empress and the Wheel of Fortune? There is another female here for some of you. And the ones that this person treated you as uh, the backup, the backup plan, plan B, okay, only seeing you sometimes. You know, you um, are having a difficult time getting over this, not wanting to be that again, okay, in that situation. But now they mean it. This is all that you need to know, Taurus, or you uh, regretted a, a decision and you want to go back and you feel that, you know, that was the one. This person was the one and was um, just really a lot of gossip around this situation. And even you using, still using your social media, still, you know, causing this person to be jealous. Or you were jealous of them because... They would have likes and comments and all of this, all of these things. So there is a um, needing to release, release this burden. Okay, we've got Leo again in the death card, Scorpio. Outcome for Taurus. Yeah, again, the two of pentacles. Oh, now the chariot. I told you, this looked like the chariot to me. And it was the Hierophant. So, Taurus Cancer here. But the, um, the chariot is you deciding to take back control of the direction of the destination. What's next? Destiny is here. So what's next for Taurus? Could be traveling overseas, deciding should I stay, should I go, should I... Some of you relocating for work where there's more job opportunities or putting in the effort again in this situation and leaving the past behind, deciding to make this a, a, a success and leave the pain behind, okay? Even if you don't um, because they're going to show some effort here or you're going to show them again the workplace is there. The workplace showing up at your workplace. Six of Cups reversed. Yeah, but some of you don't want the past. Don't want to return to yeah, you don't want to return to, or the past doesn't want to return to you, and you have to put an effort to move on, decide to move on, okay? Yeah. But I do see that for some of you, this is this person not going back on their words anymore, okay? So if they made a mistake before, they want to make changes, and even may feel that, where is this going? in August and 
but you just need to make the changes. Well, where is this going? Look. Ten of Pentacles is going into a commitment. Financial success as well for some of you, okay, in your work. So if you relocate even, there's so much more opportunities that you have near the sea because we in summer, okay, not all of us, summertime, I'm sensing that you can get like a really nice summer job near the beach or you know something that you're gonna enjoy doing even uh, driving that you have to drive you know or um yeah this is the this is at the bar you see what they do with the drinks the barmaid yeah so you've got you've got those possibilities there okay there is options for you and in terms of relationship, there is a lot of uh, uh, input that this person wants to, if they start showing you this effort, it's going into a committed relationship. Okay, let's take some Romance Angels. Taurus. New love. See, you could also meet a new person while in this uh, job. But for some of you, it's not the person that you've been with, okay? Um, even if it's someone that you met before, this is a newness. If you, haven't, um, you haven't dated them for a while or you haven't dated them at all because some of you really don't want to go back to the past. It's like... You need to change your number. You need to delete, block, and yeah, flirt and passion. Someone is flirting. It, it will be flirting with you. Passionate connection here. There is religious factors, so there could be difference of age, especially here, um, or even religious beliefs, and you walk different paths in life, so... You know, a lot of differences. Your life was completely different. Give this relationship a chance and then you're going to have to decide what you want after you spend some time with them, after you, you know, I do see seeing each other for a while and seeing where it's going. But it looks like you're meeting your soulmate or get, getting back with a soulmate. I knew there was a soulmate in the um, exterior. Let's just see some. I'm going to take three Amiras to for Taurus in August. Wow. <laughs> well, they don't want me to take three, it's four. So the young male is coming in, and because you're so attractive, Taurus, they're going to notice you. Or oh, the other way around, okay? Money travel. Hmm. This person has money, is from a different country, is. Here, there is money for you also to travel and meet new people, okay? Or this job opportunity, take it if it's abroad, okay? So all the best of uh, luck with everything and I'll see you very soon again. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Bye-bye.